Welcome to Fox TV News, where everything is true. 14-year-old in custody for double murder. The Westmoreland police are reporting that a 14-year-old has been arrested and charged while three suspects are on the run for a double murder that occurred about 3.45 a.m. in the community of Russia, Savannah Lamar. Reporters understand that armed men broke into a house in the community and opened gunfire hitting three occupants of the home while they were asleep. The deceased are 19-year-old Christian Brooks of Tarot District and 19-year-old Tenil White, otherwise called Grubber, of Cowder District in Grange Hill, who succumbed to their injury while they undergo treatment at the Savannah Lamar Public General Hospital. A third individual, 22-year-old Anthony Godfrey, also called Tonso, of a Hudson Street Savannah Lamar address, is said to be in stable condition in hospital. Sources reported that White is the younger brother of a man called Clansman, who is currently serving time in prison for murder. Tensions are building in the Westmoreland community as it is believed that there is an internal feud taking place that is threatening to escalate. Curfew imposed in Whitfield Town, Kingston. A curfew has been imposed in Whitfield Town, Kingston, effective 6 p.m. Tuesday, July 13, and will remain in effect until 6 p.m. on Thursday, July 15. The boundaries of the curfew are north along Delacree Road from Walton Park Road and Longard Avenue to Maxfield Avenue, east along Maxfield Avenue from Delacree Road to Spanish Town Road, south along Spanish Town Road from Maxfield Avenue to Walton Park Road and Longard Avenue, and west along Walton Park Road and Longard Avenue from Spanish Town Road to Delacree Road. The police said that during the hours of the curfew, all individuals within the boundaries are required to remain within their premises unless authorized in writing by the ground commander. This is the second curfew to be implemented in a community this week. Yesterday, a curfew was imposed in a section of Nagahead Portmore in St. Catherine. Please remember to subscribe, like, share, and click the notification bell for daily updates.